Dan Lawless here outside of Cardiff City Stadium, Cardiff City 2, West Ham 0, mate. That was a poor performance. Pretty spineless performance, wasn't it, from the get-go? Yeah. I think we fell in their trap today. They had a game plan, they, they did the job. They got the early goal and they, they sat off it. They defended it, frustrated us, and to be honest, they deserved the win today. Um, really poor performance, a lot of really bad individual performances as well. I thought it was right to take Anderson off at half time. I thought it was very poor. Doesn't matter if he's meant to be your best player. You've got to, a manager's got to prove that just because you're the best player on the team, you can't get in the game every, or play the full 90 minutes, basically. Uh, but Chitterita, how has he played a full 90 minutes? I have no idea. Uh, he's he's one of many people in that team that the dead would need to go. It's, I mean, yeah. what did you make of the starting lineup when you when you saw it? Did you think it was the right lineup? Did was you there's a few players you thought shouldn't have started? I would have tweaked it a little bit, but there wasn't really much. I would have said only the only person I would have said probably Antonio coming in, possibly for Snodgrass. Um, but it's all went in good thinking what the lineup's going to be. The, the players on the pitch should have done the job today. Mm. They did a great job at Newcastle the other day, and I don't really think they had put in a bad performance in Man City, but. Again, it's just individual performances. I thought Fredericks had a really poor game at right back. Um, I don't think I like Wright, so I love him to be honest. I think he's been really consistent all season, but I think that was a weak performance on his behalf. Personally, I think he improved second half. He was unlucky with the shot, but from the get go, everyone was just too switched off. And uh, fair play to card if they were frustrating. I think they were time wasting. You've got to do that if you're down the bottom, but. So it's, 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 it's a disappointing one, really. Yeah, I mean, we've seen it so many times. It's like this this inconsistent. When we come to teams like this that are fighting and we just take our foot off the pedal, I mean, do you think it's a lack of leadership? Do you think it's the manager? Do you think it's the personnel? I, I don't know what it is. Where We've seen it so many times. I don't I don't think we turn up to these games thinking, like, well, we think it's going to be an easy game, put it that way. I think, but it's, it's the Premier League. Every game's a hard game, whether you're... Up the top, down the bottom. Each team is going to be is going to have someone about them that's going to be decent enough in, to be in this league. Yeah. Um, and like I said they, they they were so quick off the blocks today, Cardiff. Even before they scored in the first five minutes, they they had a couple of decent openings, and yeah. uh, it's just such a disappointment. Especially when the last few weeks have actually been quite promising. We've improved in the performances yeah. uh, following a, a bad run at the end of January. Uh, but it's back to square one again. This is this is why we, we're not good enough for the top seven. I said to you at Wolves away, we're not good enough to get in the top seven. It's because we're inconsistent. Watford and Wolves are heads and shoulders above us, I, in, per, in, in my opinion. Yeah. I think they want it more than we do. And and also, like I said, I think there's too many players in that team. That just, they're, they're dead wood. Yeah. Hernandez has to go in the summer. Um, Perez, he's, he, he's just clear the way just because he's not even playing. Uh, personally, I think Wilshire just needs to get him off the wages away. I just Carole. release him, Carroll, and we can improve that team because there's some players in that team who like, like, like the Rices. Diop, I, Diop, obviously we conceded twice there, but I don't think he had a bad game. Fabianski made a good. I don't know whether he made a double save, but he made a good stop. Kept us in the game, but it's just like I said, it's just disappointing, especially when yeah. you come to this. Everyone was buzzing today. I think a lot of fans turned up quite early for this one and uh, yeah. been quite let down. So. On yep. to the next one. On to the next one. But yeah. Cheers, Cheers mate. Anyway. Safe journey back. Cheers.